Eric, the Swiss Army Knife here for a um, little forklift LP uh, help here. And it is regarding sometimes these lines that go to feed and connect to the tank uh, fail here and you'll get a leakage. And you really don't need to call any professional because you can do this yourself. However, there's a few things to note. One is this has a 90 degree on it. You want to keep that. This is the part that fails, which is this part, and it has a rubber boot on it. You probably won't find that rubber boot anywhere because it's old school, but you can slide it off and slide it back onto this other one with probably little or uh, no trouble. The other part of this is a lot of times you're, you know, not knowing um, how this is, how the forklifts are built. They're built pretty well for service. So if you're trying to work in this confined area, don't and look for a release knob or release button that will allow this to swing out and then you can get at it you can loosen it and do all you need to do so that i hope really helps um, somebody that's just starting or, or needs to get this swapped out they're a small office can't afford to have a guy come out that's what you do